We're here today at the uh, New Sheriff's Conference here at the FSA. Very exciting time for new sheriffs. This is the beginning of a four-year adventure. I started the class this morning as we talked about the transition and, and getting into the role of sheriff. And my message today was looking forward because if you're not sure of where you're going, you won't, you won't go anywhere. And so my uh, admonition to them was, Try to imagine where you want to be four years from today. You want to be getting ready to get sworn in soon for your second term. And the only way they can do that is to be strategic, to have integrity, to have courage, and to be willing to look forward and bring the sheriff's office to where it needs to be. Every sheriff's office is a standalone industry. Uh, most of us have jails to run. We, we have aviation units. We have of marine units, we have school resource officers, we have internet crimes. I mean, we, we have big industries. Myself, I have a, a $60 million uh, sheriff's office, and it's a big industry. And I'll drive in there oftentimes as I'm coming around the gate, and I look over, I see, I see the 700-bed jail, I see uh, the administrative building, and I think, my word, there's a lot of responsibility here. And the people of Martin County, my county, expect me every day to live up to uh, my oath of office and to serve the men and women of the sheriff's office and serve the men and women and the, the people that live in Martin County. We have sheriffs coming in that have rather large sheriff's offices and then we have the more rural, smaller sheriff's offices, but they'll all face a singular challenge and that is to determine exactly how they want their sheriff's office to look. What will be the model uh, that they want to follow? You know, we want to, as sheriffs, be professional, be courteous, be thoughtful, be professional. And that's what we're stressing here at the uh, Florida Sheriff's New Sheriff's Training Academy. And that is that they are the ones that the men and women in their agency will look at, and they are the ones that the people in the community hold responsible for their safety. If I were to tell all the new sheriffs one thing, today, I, I would like to get across to them, avoid the sin of arrogance. Because with great power co comes great responsibility. And you can take the power that's given to you as a sheriff and treat it like dynamite. It's very unstable. If you use it right, it's, it's for the good of the agency and for your people. But if you use it wrong, it will blow you up.